Hi guys, so now the most uh, interesting part, I guess, from the messenger unit, the electronics package. So it came off as a single block, and it is a sandwich of uh, PCBs, soldered each side onto a motherboard. So it is not coming apart further than this. So. Here is the side we were able to see when the, it was mounted in the frame with the two vacuum tubes here. I will try to remove this cover and see what the tubes are. Two transformers here. Behind here, I can guess uh, capacitors. And here we had uh, two uh, similar uh, stages, maybe uh, output stages from the gyros with a uh, miniature tube. So this is the side from the, under the cover of the frame with the wires and the plugs. You can see the strain uh, relief, reliefs on the wires here and uh, how it is connected. You can see it is a, a regular PCB, brown PCB with lots of tracks uh, and it just connects the uh, stack of PCBs here, this side, we have, the, we can see there are four vacuum tubes, four big vacuum tubes of a, with a regular socket, and you can see it is written block electronic 809, serial number 1174, Matra, some more uh, tracks here, thicker tracks, or power supply maybe. Here we have a potted assembly. No clue what there is inside, maybe a transformer, something like this. And here we have four very interesting units. They are uh, plugged in uh, vacuum tube sockets. And it is written uh, type uh, 615 with uh, serial numbers uh, 10,982 and 83 here and these two ones are not uh, matching numbers so you have uh, voltage and uh, resistance value written on them maybe they are relays I could uh, remove them with removing this bracket but the screws back here are very tiny and uh, locked in place by the conformal coating so it uh, will not be able to remove easy to remove here we have uh, some uh, insulating sheet as you can see there is one more large PCB behind there so maybe this will come off the screws and do not seem to be too much uh, locked in place here no they will not come off this one comes off. So it is a problem with really, really old tiny screws. And you want to remove them. Yes. I was lucky this time. So, what do we have here? We just have. Uh, more PCB, more conformal coating, some uh, small resistors and stuff here, resistors, capacitors. So looks like we have uh, glass body diodes. So at least this thing use diodes. You have uh, more uh, information of a PCB number here. And uh, what else? We have here the free connectors, of course, that connects to the Rotary converter and the gyroscopes. And this nice uh, insulating uh, uh, material sheet you can see with uh, cutoffs to match exactly the solder uh, points on the board here. So, really, really nicely done. I do not want to know the original cost of this thing back in the 60s it was really at the 
Edge of uh, Electronics Technology back in the time, so I will put back the screws later. So what do we have else? So this side we did already see. You can see there is some fun uh, found done at the bottom here to keep things in place. We have also the all the conformal coating. So transformers here. Some. Uh, so this seems to be a mirror of the other one at the bottom. So it really looks like we have two similar stages on the one uh, power supply unit here. And, uh, and nothing is coming uh, off else. So even if I remove these screws, it is uh, soldered in place each side. So I will just try to remove one of the tube covers, but they are really, really, really hard to push because there is a spring inside. So I do not want to break the tube, so I do not, uh, I will not do it. Okay, so this is the main electronics pack, as you can see, really well made, really. Uh, a sandwich of uh, PCBs, really compact. Designing this thing back in the 60s without computer was really a challenge, I guess. And uh, lots of lots of work on engineer work, probably in this. Because from the schematic and the form factor you want to achieve to fit the thing in the machine, how to organize things all together. Considering also the reliability issues and so on, it was really uh, something, I guess. Okay, so I will uh, put this together, and uh, in the next video, I will uh, reassemble the railroad unit. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.